from this jump. Um, and Serpentine will hold. That, they won't go liggety split early doors, but it'll be building as they roll out of the straight and then roll down the hill. Positivity just rolls forward and fits in. Fantastic gate speed, this four-year-old mare. Look for her to take a posse and get that ski into the race. That is for sure. James McDonald will have to go back and then wind up down the side. You watch him make a run from the 650 because he's going to need a good lung burner if he's going to run in a Melbourne Cup is your favourite in Francesco Gatti. Yep, looking forward to this one. Plenty of chances. Here's Matt Hill. St George's in, Francesco Guardi, James McDonald, who's won the last two editions of this, the first of them on this horse. And just fine, Geordie Childs, who put in a master class at Flemington on this galloper last time, about to load and sharp and smart as well. Written by Craig Williams, who won this race with precedence in 2013. So the field just about right for the Group 2 Mooney Valley Gold Cup. Just fine as in, the field is set. Our feature of the night. Serpentine bouncing around and they're racing. Akita Susi jumped well with Manzois Hurricane and there's our deeper on the course, just fine as well, pushing up. Serpentine holding the rails. Positivity is also in that leading group. Back in the field, Hurricane midfield, followed by Braden Star, sharp and smart, and well back in the field is St George and also Francesco Gardi. They come around the home corner, 2,100 metres to go, and it's just fine. Steadily working across to lead Manzois positivity. And then came Serpentine fourth on the rails from Akita Sushi. A gap to Hurricane Braden Star, sharp and smart. Second last St George, Francesco Gardi is last. At the posts, a lap of the valley to go under the lights and it's just fine the leader by a length and a half to positivity who's getting a little bit closer as they leave the running at the 1700 meters third is Manzois and fourth is Akita Sushi then came Serpentine fifth locked away on the rails a length and a quarter Hurricane then came Braden Star sharp and smart Francesco Gardi and St George the Grey as last 1400 to go so it's just fine for Geordie Childs rating this runner about a length and a quarter second is Positivity and third is Manzois as they swing towards the back section as Childs is just stopping and starting them at the moment. Akita Sushi fourth one off the fence at the 1200 metres. A length and a half to Serpentine and Hurricane. A length and a quarter Braden Star. Then came Sharp and Smart Francesco Gardi and St George is at the tail of the field and no change in the order in the Mooney Valley Gold Cup. Just find the leader by a length Positivity off the back section at the 850. Then came Manzois third from Akita Sushi still on the bridle. A length and a half Serpentine and Hurricane and then came Sharp and Smart under pressure from Braden Star at the 650. Francesco Gardi still last with St George. Just fine. 550 metres to go with Positivity about to throw down a threat. Akita Sushi's looming up on the outside as well and the race is on in the Gold Cup at the 450. Behind those Manzois Serpentine is sliding into it and Braden Star is on the inside, needs a run badly. Akita Sushi's gone to the front though, around the turn of the 200 metres. Akita Sushi a length and three quarters Serpentine followed by down the outside sharp and smart. Akita Sushi at the 100 from Serpentine Akita Sushi three quarters Serpentine Akita Sushi holding on and wins. A half Serpentine sharp and smart, third from Braden Star luckless. Then came St George Francesco Gardi Manzois Positivity Hurricane and last after leading was just fine. You simply cannot stop him. Kieran Ma is in a juggernaut at the moment and he adds the Mooney Valley Gold Cup to an unbelievable weekend last weekend where he won an Everest and a Caulfield Cup. And he does it with Akita Sushi, who he has purchased through clients. And by G, he's finally settled into Australia in red hot form. Defeat Serpentine, who runs a slashing race for the Williams team. Akita Sushi has got the eye on the Melbourne Cup. He was order of entry about 33 hutch. He'll go up a notch now. That was a terrific win. And there was a nibble at him at longer odds as well.